This is the way to make a call on an automatic telephone. First, make sure that you know the number you mean to dial. Then, lift the receiver and listen for the dialing tone, a low-pitched, continuous purring sound like this. When you hear that tone, but not before, dial the number you want. In half a minute at most, you should hear one of the other tones I shall describe. If you do not, press down the receiver rest for at least two seconds and dial again. There are three tones which you may hear after dialing. The ringing tone, or the engaged tone, or the number unobtainable tone. The ringing tone is a pair of low-pitched burring sounds repeated with a fairly long pause after each pair, like this. It means that the number you dialed is being rung, but people may not be able to answer at once, so wait at least half a minute before giving up the call. The engaged tone is a high-pitched note interrupted at regular intervals, like this. It means that the number you dialed, or some of the machinery on the way to it, is engaged. So put back the receiver and wait two minutes before dialing again. The number unobtainable tone is a high-pitched note without interruptions, like this. When you hear this, put back the receiver and look up the directory to make sure you have the number right. Then lift the receiver, listen for dialing tone, and carefully dial again. If you hear the number unobtainable tone again, you may assume that the number cannot be obtained. Now run over these four tones again. Dialing tone. Ringing tone. Engaged tone. Number unobtainable tone. Besides these, a time signal of three sharp pips is given every three minutes on trunk and toll calls to warn you that if you go on, there will be an extra charge. Here it is. <laughs>